Hey everyone, it's Rachel. Today, I want to dive into a topic that's got people on both sides of the fence. You might have heard about some clubs and bars in Korea that have been turning away foreigners, especially those who don't look Korean or Asian. Well, this is called racial discrimination or racial profiling, and it's got people feel some type of way. Some people think that these policies are just plain unfair, while other people say that it's necessary to maintain a safe environment which I don't know what okay here are some examples check this out this one says only Koreans are allowed because our employees are not able to communicate in English it's not a racist wow like it's not a racist sorry please be generous about it what straight up no foreigners Americans are not welcome here wow foreigners cannot enter this club I mean, this is crazy, right? I know this is really upsetting, but before you get too upset, I should tell you that not all clubs in Korea is like that. And there are plenty of spots that welcome everyone with open arms, no matter where they are from. So, uh, yeah. But today, we are talking about those clubs that ban foreigners from entering. So, without any further ado, let's get into it. Okay. There are a few arguments on both sides of this issue. Some people think that banning foreigners from clubs is the way to go, and here are their reasons. First, they believe that it is all about safety. They think that keeping non-Korean customers out of clubs will make everyone have a good time without any violence. <laughs> it's Ah, oh, the assumption. They say that foreigners can be a bit rowdy and cause trouble sometimes. Well, second of all, they argue that Korean clubs have a unique cultural vibe that might not be appreciated by foreigners. Wow. They believe that Koreans are more likely to understand and appreciate the atmosphere, and foreigners can make things uncomfortable for them. Oh, um, it's really hard to listen to them, right? It's funny because if the vibe is that great, it's so much better when, when it's celebrated by more people than just Koreans. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's wild to me to ban people because their vibe is, um, no, you're not allowed because we've got something special going on. But hey, not everyone agrees with these arguments. Obviously, I believe that banning foreigners is plain old discrimination, which is not cool at all. Every person should be treated fairly and with respect, no matter where they are from. Also, banning foreigners is not a good thing to Koreans either. I don't know why some clubs don't see this, uh, because it could actually harm the tourism industry in Korea. If tourists feel unwelcome or discriminated against, they're not gonna come back. They're not stupid. Um, and we don't want that, right? In my case, I've been fortunate enough to travel to many countries as a tourist. And some of my best memories have been made while dancing with friends in bars and clubs. Those moments were an absolute blast. I can only imagine how devastated I would feel if I were to be banned from a club in a foreign country while all of my friends were allowed in. That would be really super sad. It would be so disheartening and make me feel so left out and unwelcome. Uh, I can only imagine how terrible and embarrassing that would be. It will be a memory that would haunt me forever, no matter how nice the country was. I would never want to go there ever again. That is why I'm so passionate about making sure that foreigners who come to Korea never experience anything like that, ever. I truly believe that we can find solutions and bring more attention to this issue. That is why I'm making this video so that we can work together towards creating a more welcoming and inclusive environment for everyone. Let's be real, no matter where someone comes from or what they look like, everyone deserves to be treated with respect and kindness. It's easy. It's simply not okay to exclude people from bars and clubs just because of their nationality or ethnicity. It's ridiculous. And 
I'm telling you, it's an easy one. Um, it's so easy to see why it's so wrong. When we do that, um, we're creating social barriers and perpetuating discrimination, which can totally bring down society as a whole. And what are we as people who do that? Like, I don't know why we don't see it together. So let's talk about finding a solution that works in the comment down below. Guys, leave me comments. One area we can explore is safety concerns. We understand that some clubs may have worries about illegal activities or safety risks, and that makes sense. Of course, we can address these concerns without excluding anyone, and that's the point. We can do that, I believe. And also, it's not just about safety measures. It's also about creating an atmosphere where everyone feels comfortable and included. So a sign said, sorry, we cannot speak in English. Well, if that was the issue, Clubs can provide language support to better understand and communicate with foreign guests, right? It also can help foreign guests understand the rules and regulations of the club, vice versa. So it's good for both sides. They can create a more welcoming and enjoyable experience for everyone. What do you guys think? I am all for inclusivity and diversity. I truly believe that it's super important for everyone to feel welcome and included. <laughs> regardless of where they come from. I don't know, maybe I strongly feel this way because I once was also, for many times, a stranger or a foreigner in other countries as well. And I know how I would feel if I had the same experience. That would be just like so hurtful. I know some clubs might have their reasons, their own reasons for not allowing foreigners, but we need to find ways to be more inclusive and embrace diversity. Discrimination can never be an answer and we all need to take responsibility for making the world a better place. So let's work together and spread the love. Okay guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know what you think about this topic with your comments down below because I really believe that when we raise the awareness, we can solve this issue and I really want to hear your thoughts. So yeah, please do um, and also leave me anything you want and I will see you in the next one. Bye!